Hi, and welcome to a short video about bioethanol fireplaces. Maybe you're completely new to the world of bioethanol fireplaces and you don't really know what they are and what they do and how they function. I will tell you about some of the key features and the main differences between the different models. So when you have watched this video, you will be a bioethanol fireplace expert yourself. A bioethanol fireplace is a fireplace that burns bioethanol and not wood, gas or oils as you might know it from different kinds of fireplaces. The key feature of the bioethanol fireplace is that it does not require a connection to a flu system. This is because when burning bioethanol you only create heat and CO2. But because that it creates CO2 there are some requirements to the size of the room that the fireplace is installed in. This requirement is different from fireplace to fireplace but the rule of thumb is that the bigger the fireplace, the bigger the room should be. I would recommend you to check the product description of our fireplaces on the website where we have explained the minimum room size requirements for each individual fireplace. Bioethanol is the fuel for your bioethanol fireplace. Bioethanol is a liquid that is made from leftover products from the productions of potatoes, corns, beets and similar sugar-rich vegetables. Today, bioethanol is used in many common products, for example in household cleaning utilities and also mixed with the gasoline for your car. When shopping for bioethanol for your bioethanol fireplace, it is really important that you only buy bioethanol that is meant to be burned inside of a bioethanol fireplace. We always recommend a bioethanol with an alcohol percentage between 95 to 97.5% of alcohol. Usually, it's not a problem to buy a bioethanol with a lower alcohol percentage, but I would never recommend you to buy a bioethanol with a higher alcohol percentage than 97.5% of alcohol. This is because that it burns both hotter and quicker, and not all bioethanol fireplaces are meant to withstand this extra heat from the bioethanol. But always check the manual included with your bioethanol fireplace so that you make sure that you get the correct fuel for your fireplace. Yes, a bioethanol fireplace does create heat. Most of them somewhere between 2 to 3 kilowatts of heat effect. But if you want to compare it to something that most of us are familiar with, then a wood burning fireplace usually gives about 6 kilowatts of heat, so the heat effect of a bioethanol fireplace is somewhere between one third of the heat effect from the wood burning fireplace. How much heat a bioethanol fireplace can create in your room is unfortunately very difficult to answer, since it depends on the room size and how well the room is insulated. But usually it can heat up rooms from 20 to 40 square meters with a pleasant heat. But you should not use a bioethanol fireplace as the primary heat source, since it can be quite expensive to fuel compared to other alternatives. Today, you will usually find two types of bioethanol fireplace, the manual or the automatic. There are pros and cons for both of them, but usually the bioethanol fireplace that you buy will be equipped with one or the other, and it's not possible to change it around. The exception being built-in fireplaces, whereas on some models you have the option to choose whether you want the manual or the automatic. The manual burner is the cheapest option, and its main strength is that it does not require any connection to electricity. This means that bioethanol fireplaces equipped with a manual burner can be placed almost anywhere. When using the manual burner, it should usually be filled up before each use and it is ignited with a lighter. Adjusting and turning off the flame is done by adjusting the flow of air. Automatic bioethanol burners has built-in safety sensors that can automatically turn off the fireplace if any error is detected. The bioethanol is stored within an airtight fuel tank inside of the burner. This means that you do not need to refill the fireplace before each use, but only when the fuel tank is empty. Additionally, some of the automatic burners offers the possibility to remote control them using a remote an app for your mobile phone or a smart home system. Because bioethanol fireplaces does not require a connection to a flu system, then the manufacturers and designers of the fireplaces has created a lot of different styles and designs. Uh, usually they fall into one of four categories. 
The first being mounted fireplaces that can either be mounted onto the wall or to the ceiling using a mounting bracket and a couple of screws. Freestanding bioethanol fireplaces that require no installation. They come in a lot of different sizes and can be used freestanding on the floor, on the table and in some cases be used as a freestanding insert that you can place into your existing fireplace. Built-in bioethanol fireplaces that can be built into a wall or other types of building projects where you want to see the flames from the fireplace from one, two, three or even more sides of the fireplace. If you want to build your own bioethanol fireplace, you can also choose to just buy the bioethanol burner unit and build the surroundings of the fireplace yourself to your style and your needs. This has just been a short introduction to bioethanol fireplaces. I hope you have learned something and are now ready to explore uh, our wide range of fireplaces on the website. If you have any further questions, don't hesitate to contact our customer service on phone 